All right, cool beans. Streets at 55. I have Sackhead. I have Judas's tongue, and I have the D100. I also have two soul hearts. I have like no tier rate and damage. I also don't have flight, which would be great here. Man, I'm actually kind of tempted. You know what? Let's do it. Oh no. Wait, I just got take X. Oh heck yeah. I got tech X. I have even less tier right now, but I have tech X, and just like that, I will never use the D100 again for the rest of the run. I shouldn't have done it in a room full of entities, though, because I could have easily died there. If I don't cheat, how come I never hit Mother plus Boss Rush? Yeah, I wonder. I wonder why I never hit that. You might want to inspect the wheel. To, to maybe try and figure that one out. I also got a soul heart from that thing. It, it literally just rolled Sackhead into Tech X. How does it do that anyway? Sackhead is. The prosy is cool. Wait, Sackhead is a, is a shop item, right? And Tech X isn't. How did it roll that? I'm assuming because it was Eden's starting item, it just rolls into a random pool. Because it usually is supposed to stay within the pool it rolls from. Or maybe it doesn't on D100, I'm not sure. Man, I need some damage and tier rate on this bad boy. Because right now I can't even fire by just repeatedly tapping my fire button. That's how low my tier rate is. At least the damage is bad. The damage is hella bad. Like, this is absolutely some of the worst damage ever. But I'm still feeling rather confident. I have a burnt penny. I can totally go for this. And see if it's there. A golden key on basement one where all the doors are instantly unlocked. Amazing. Man, I'm so glad that this is the floor I got the golden key on. Man, I love the part where I'm not dealing damage. That is my favorite part. Die! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, this might be a problem if we don't find damage fast. Like... <laughs> what the heck, man? He just doesn't die! You know... Oh, dang it. Remember... Remember when this game was new? Okay, hold up. I need to shut up and focus here because otherwise I'm about to prove the exact point I'm trying to make. Should save the bomb for the boss fight. Anyone remember when this game was new and everyone was absolutely terrified by horns? And it could have been a legit run ender just now. It could have totally been a run ender just now. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I, we need to find some damage ASAPissimo. That being said, we do have the hardest, um, we do have the hardest boss out of the way for the early game. So, uh, this floor, save for, oh, nice. Save for any unfortunate champion molly booms. We should be in a fairly safe position for the next full floor. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna... I don't want to accidentally tap the thing. That would have been great in that room where I was complaining about not having flight. Because that's kind of flight. It's a very creative form of flight, but it is a form of flight. I'm pretty sure that's not... There's nothing that flight can do that how to jump can't. Except maybe avoid creep a bit more consistently, I guess. I guess. What do we got? What do we got? TM trainer incoming. Uh, no. 
I, I hate to uh, destroy your hope here, chat, but the chances of this turning into a TM trainer run are basically zero at this point. Basically zero. I love the part where I'm just not getting any coins to generate bombs off. Alright, who needs to generate bombs from coins if you can just find bombs though? Do, 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 do. Your boy needs some damage! This is Mega Satan Chest Path, right? So I don't have a time limit, which means I definitely want to look around a bit more. This is another one of these rooms where it's impossible for me to tell uh, where the secret room is going to be, unless there's a room above this one. Ah! Oh man, this is ridiculous. Like, this is the worst damage I've ever seen on Tech X. Amazing how bad that item can be when it doesn't have any support. It's okay though, we'll get there. Isn't the secret room next to the It's probably above the store, yeah. I just wanted to see if there's a, a more likely slot. And it's also not guaranteed. It could very easily be to the left or right of the of the curse room. Okay, do you want to give me like a devil card for the boss fight? Like that would already be so much help. Hermit. That doesn't help me. Not for the devil deal. <laughs> Regenerating Ragman incoming. That would be tragic. Oh, not there. That's probably to the left or the right of the... This is really risky. If it's regenerating Ragman, I might actually not have a way of killing him. I'm just gonna lose all my bombs, am I? Bro, dude, why do I even bother to look for the secret room on these early floors? I'm desperate enough to go for this. Yeah. Okay, Bogo Bombs. Double all bomb drops would be pretty nice, but I don't have the money. I'll take a bomb just in case it's going to do anything against the boss. Just don't be regenerating Ragman. Be something easy. Be, I don't know, Monstro. Gurglings, that's fine. Not even champion Gurglings. Just, just Gurglings. Just plain old Gurglings. Look at how little health they have compared to Haunt as well. Like, somebody really hated Isaac players when they decided Haunt's health pool. Okay, not really any point in going to the Devil deal. We do get some more range because that is definitely one of the most important things you can find with Tech X. I, I could, in theory, take an item, but. Hey, watermelon. Yeah. Bob the precog. Yeah, I also need the key. True. But I mean, I, I always find a way to get the key. But yeah, I mean, there's no way to go in. There's no reason to go in there. Uh, Curse of the Blind. Okay, maybe this is going to turn into a TM trainer run. Who knows? You know, I just uploaded today's video and it's the one with the pyro start and the 99 bombs where I used all of them over the course of the entire run. That was a banger, by the way, releasing later today for you Twitch viewers. Uh, you should watch that. This could turn into the exact same run with the burn penny, though. <laughs> just get Libra at this point. I mean, Libra would actually be great here. I think Libra would actually be a take, and then I would be getting damage and tears ups for the entire rest of the run. But yeah, right now, Libra seems pretty dope. Oh my god. You know what also seems pretty dope right now? Polyphemus.
I'm so glad this run doesn't have a time limit because otherwise I would have probably popped the D100 again after seeing how weak this uh, Tech X is. We're getting all the golden chests, but unfortunately no items from them. Uh-oh. Can I... no. Can I use one of these guys to get in here? No, because there's no door here. Ooh. Three chests. Zoop. Three bombs. Uh. You know, it's not the worst bomb beggar I've ever seen, considering I have the burnt penny. Unfortunately, their payout rate is so low that I still feel like it's not really worth it unless you have an infinite supply of bombs. I don't know. I mean, bombs are going to be really useful here, right? Because our damage is so low. Nope. I'm, I'm desperate, but not quite that desperate. I'm more like desperate to make this run more convenient. Because right now, Tech X isn't particularly threatened. I'm just worried I'm going to die of old age before I finish this one. I mean, I have, a, I have virtually an infinite supply of bombs, but let's be optimal anyway. Okay. Satanic Bible. I can't, I, I can pop that at the end of the floor. If I pop it now, I'm going to get a devil deal at the end of the boss room. And I can't take that because it would lock in devil deals. So I can't possibly uh, pop that. And regret this. Never mind. No ragrets. Except I would like my bomb back, but. Okay, that's actually my 50th cent over there. It's a very significant amount of cents. Oh my god. Dear Lord Pro Oh, I took it I took a hit there because of Mr. Cheever. Because I was reading his message. Dear Lord props deal some damage. I'm trying, bro! I'm actually trying. I, I know it doesn't look like it. But I'm trying to. I'm I, I need something here. Coupon. Yeah, sure. I'm committed now. I might actually get my how to jump back for this one. Because I want the golden chest. I could also just use two out of my bombs to get all of them and save me some time. Again, it's not like I'm really have a shortage of bombs with the burnt penny in my inventory. Burnt penny is just so good. It's one of those trinkets where I really wonder why the matchbook exists when the burnt penny is a thing. But I realize that they're they're two separate trinkets that work independently from one another, but it's still fascinating to me how they made one of them good and the other one not. Bob Satanic Bible, then coupon the boss deal. I could do that. But I could also get an item that's more likely useful from the boss pool. Because everything in the boss pool is useful except for the lone range up that's still in there because I already have two. I think there's only three in there. Like, my point is I've already even, like, thinned out the pool from a bunch of range ups, so the boss pool... It's even more attractive right now than it usually is. <sighs> sure. Hydrate. I do not actually have anything to drink right here. All right, at least it's an easy boss. I thought I missed. Oh, that actually hit. Oops. 
Okay, do we at least get the instant angel deal? You know, I'm not even too sad about that. I'm not even too sad about missing that angel room. Because like, imagine fighting red angel <laughs> with this. That would have not been a good time. Let's pop the Q4. Man, I'm gonna need help on this upcoming floor because otherwise I'm in doo-doo. We're we're not in a great position right now. If I if I have to go to depths with this. It might not end well for me. The tier rate is already pretty nice because now I don't have to charge the thing as far anymore. So I'm pretty happy with that one, even though shot speed is generally pretty undesirable with uh with the tech x oh i messed up i'm trying really hard to get a magic mushroom here too in case you didn't notice no prevents active items from spawning i think i want to keep the burn penny even though that's a fantastic trinket coupon is also not really the kind of item you want to keep for the end game nice I'd be okay with an angel teleport. Would I take soy milk here? I, I, I do not want to think about that until I find soy milk. Probably. I mean, soy milk is good now. As of repentance. Okay, so here's the deal. I'm gonna buy the three cent heart. And then I'm gonna coupon. First try, the birthright. Mm. That's okay, we're, we're still gonna get some coupons here. We found the shop fairly early, which is always good. An incredibly good run the other day, so I became even better today. Yeah, I mean, soy milk's good now. I, I, I refuse to believe it for quite a while as well, but soy milk is just straight up takeable. I'd still rather find Polly here, but boiled baby. All right. Eh, might as well take it with us. Super gluttony. Finally tripled your DPS. <laughs> I feel like that's a bit generous. chest i only have three keys not sure yet if i want to open this but i'll keep it in mind and maybe come back for it because it is something you generally want to try and open oh show oh god oh okay one down two down
<laughs> nice. The combo play. All right, let's go back and hit that birthright, ladies and gents. Two fat damage ups in the chance. I'm gonna check to see. Yeah, plot twist. It's gonna need four keys to open. It's it's gonna do what I think it will, right? We're gonna get another use, and then it's gonna hit the hearts. Uh, you've already seen the secret room, though. I, I want to go in there, right? There could be a bunch of money in there. I feel like it's a higher odds play than to go for the big chest right now. It's a mini battery. I'm actually desperate enough for money and I have enough bombs to go for those two cents. Forty-eight hour energy in your inventory. I checked the seed. Man, lots of seed checkers today. kill the big boy i feel like i've seen the big boy go down twice now already and i couldn't take him out in time bro he literally regenerates faster than i can kill him let me kill the small boys first even those are kind of a challenge Okay, got him. I don't know how, but I got him. Can't go in there. Whee! I'm bad. All right, let's get birthright. <laughs> Let us get the right of the birth. Let's also get the super secret room. The super secret room. Oh, that's a free angel fight. You can actually fight the angel in the super secret room. That's lucky. That is really lucky. What are the odds? I mean, it was five items at the start. That shouldn't be that hard to math out. It's one in five times one in four times one in three times one in two. Five times four is 20. Times three is 60. One in 120. Is that right? <laughs> Point 0.1 DPS. I'll be back. <laughs> Could I have bought the red heart? No, it was five cents, I think. Uh, okay, I'm doing it. For the potential to get enough money to get birthright, I think this is worth it. I got scammed. Um, okay, let's do this first. See if we hit the angel room. See if we maybe get a damage up. See if we get Mega Fatty, who has more health than all the other caves bosses combined. Sure. And I accidentally blew up that thing. Man, I keep seeing the... The Leprosy duders. I keep seeing the Leprosy duders and I'm like, oh, I have uh, uh, orbitals. I should use these. And then I remember, right, these orbitals actually die. That didn't hit. I'm so sad.
It's like an idle clicker game now without the idle. <laughs> Oh, was it three cents? Maybe I'm stupid. I don't know. Maybe I... I couldn't buy it, though, because I have full Red Heart containers, right? All right. There's an Angel Room. There's more Tyrant. Oh, well, I mean, Jesus chooses damage, at least. I'm not going to take Habit and then hit myself. Am I? <laughs> I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm I'm desperate enough to do that. Okay, it's Blue Angel first. That's nice. Ah, actually, that wouldn't matter. I need to hit myself anyway. But I kind of want to beat the angels first and then hug a fire or something because we'll have to see how much damage I take against Uriel. Frankly, not too worried about Gabriel. Which is this guy. With Uriel, at least I know how to make him hit the... How to make him hit the uh, fires. But that helps. This is Uriel? Really? I thought red one was Gabriel. Okay, you know what I mean. I keep... I, I don't know. This is me trying to actually flex my Isaac knowledge and failing horribly. I should have just called him Red and Blue Angel. I should have just called them Red and Blue Angel, my bad. Is there any way I can still get a key on this floor to open that chest? I'll just I'll just get skeleton key from Birthright, easy peasy. <laughs> Easy and hard, Angel. Okay, place the bomb like this so I don't get the fires. So I can make him hug them. As much as I would love to blow up these fires for potential uh, soul hearts. I need them for additional DPS here. This guy mostly chases you down too, so it's actually fairly easy to get him to run into fires. Not like with Blue Angel, who does like this weird pattern to try and get above you. But it's not consistent either, otherwise I could just park myself underneath a fire and watch them hug it. Might have actually gone by faster than the other Angel fight simply because of the fires. I think that was faster than the other one. Okay, just like that, we got the entire key. And now, for the grand finale, we're going to find out that this was absolutely not worth it. Yup. <laughs> it's not terrible. I mean, you, you know my stance on Dry Baby. That, that's actually pretty good. Dry Baby is actually pretty good. Why not the sacrifice room to hit myself? Because the sacrifice room does a full heart of damage to me every time I hit myself. And I I can't afford to take that kind of damage right now. Oh man. Would that have been Eternal Hearts if I popped it in the Angel Room? I'm not 100% on that. I was hoping for a Bombs Archipel, but... Oh, brother. Okay. I mean, the build has improved on that last floor. I don't have keys. The build has improved on that last floor. It's definitely not where I want it to be yet, but... We are getting closer to our goal for sure. 
And we have the full key and a red heart container, so I can go to the devil deal. If I get one. It's always a pretty big boon. Dry baby is damaged, that's true. And a hell of a lot of it too. The problem is in a room like this where no enemy fires at me, dry baby does nothing. That's one of the, the big problems with that guy. Or a room like this, you know? I, you need to be fast in that room. You just gotta clear it before the enemies just even start firing. Really? This is a dead end. That's so sad. He still keeps you company, that's worth. Sure. Let's go with that. I like that last floor better where I found this door pretty much instantly. It was a lot more convenient for my coupon. Man. I miss the times when I actually dealt damage in my runs. Those were good times. Big old props getting dry, baby, and no enemy that shoots. Only on runs where I'm already struggling. If this run was already won, like if I had Sacred Heart here together with my Tech X, I would get firing enemies every single room. And then dry, baby, would go off a million times and it wouldn't matter. But it's okay. We live for the challenge, right? That guy jumped on me. At least this isn't the unbeatable seed. The seed had the potential to be unbeatable. Like, make it regenerating Ragman on one of the first two floors. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have been able to get past that. Like, there, there was definitely some potential for some... fishy business... in this one. I have not seen this room in ages. This one was really common back in the, the Rebirth days. And it was like an infamous time waste in the racing scene as well. Thanks, Dry Baby. It was an infamous time waste in the racing scene as well. Like, you'd see that room a lot in Rebirth. It was like, here you go, first item tech X and disappears. It wasn't even, it was even more comical. Because we started really bad damage and tier rate and the D100. So I just re-rolled my starting build. And it gave me tech X, but lowered both my damage and my tier rate. Hmm. I don't even care to use that, do I? Well, might as well now. Magician is a great one. Another magician. Okay. I'm not going for the golden pill. Nope. You can't tempt me, chat. Rocket in a jar, okay. Pills, damage. Oh yeah. Oh wow, I thought that would get the hand too. Was that two hands or did the first one just drop again really fast? No, the first one just dropped really fast again. Okay. Oh. Rob's unlike chat doesn't chuck pills. Rob's also has no idea where the secret room is supposed to be.
Oh, is it above the, the curse room? That'd be a pretty good location. Bot knife! Heck yeah. Oh, sweet. Greed's gullet. I, that's most likely not going to do anything, but that item is so rare that I'm going to have to go and get it. <laughs> I'm actually a big fan of that black heart. Because if I get hit on the boss now, that's just going to be an easy 100 damage. Check the seed, it's all good pills. Yeah, I don't believe that for a second. <laughs> ah, what? That's not where your shadow went to? What the heck? Jeez. Calm down. This fight normally doesn't last as long. Oh! He got me at the end. Have I increased my damage since this run started? I mean, I passed on Jesus Juice. That's kind of my fault, but... <sighs> What the heck, man? I'm gonna resist the temptation to take the pills. Necropolis 1. And Isaac takes mini shoot, literally. Do, do, do. I priestess and use that right here, whatever. I mean, I have six keys now. I might as well check in on that key room, but. We're very likely not going to use that. D4, no regrets. <laughs> I think I could still have a lot of regrets. Like this looks bad, but I it, it can be it could be much worse. <laughs> I'm going to think about that. I I really don't think I'm going to use this, but I'm legitimately tempted. I'm legitimately tempted. That's gonna stay on the ground. Uh-oh. Oh, hold up, I want these guys to check for the super uh, the secret room for me. Thank you. Other one? Okay. That's worth half a heart to get that. I think. I don't know, with the burn penny, is it really worth it? Maybe not. What's the worst that could happen? I can think of a million things that could happen that would be real bad. TM trainer can't happen, I don't think, because we don't have a secret room item. Although the first one on the D100 roll didn't re-roll correctly. So I don't know, maybe that could be... Oh, hi! Hi! Oh man. Hold up, I don't want to destroy the reroll machine yet. I feel like we could still make some things happen here, except if that guy doesn't give me five cents. Mm. I'll just blow it up. Am I? Nah, I'm greedy. But now you'll re-roll those, or, and hear me out here, I won't.
not re-rolling is the zero DPS. No, no, don't worry. Cricket's head in this item room, trust. Hmm. Is that Cricket's jaw jawbone by chance? You really love the 2.33 damage. No, I love the tech X. That's what I love. Man, he back, dang it. Really a 20 minute Mega Satan encounter. I will not argue against that. I'm gonna blow it up now. It's not gonna have much time left in anyway. Compost? I don't think so. Still want to fill that up. I could potentially get a devil deal on this floor that I might want to use this on, so. Hmm. Man, we're really min maxing a lot here, are we? This is the kind of video that I pull up in the editor and then I see it's over an hour long and I'm like okay where is the 15 minute lady prop segment where we just spend chatting that I have to cut out and then I look through it and I'm like wait there isn't one what did I do and then I rewatch it and I'm like ah yes I see You know, I do have the hematemesis pill identified. That would be a good one to find right now. I'm so tempted to pop the magician here, but I absolutely need to save that for Mega Satan. I mean, I, really? Okay, thanks, Fanny Pack. Already been to the secret room. That's unfortunate. I could use another secret room right now. I could definitely use another secret room right now. Really? Okay. Probs, if you rolled your belt, you would get Parasite, Sacred Heart, Cricket's Body, I promise. Oh, I thought that was the... I, I thought that was the Hematemesis for a second. I don't know why I thought that, but... I thought it. Where's the super secret? I, like, I would really like to find that. Might as well. Increases knockback. Hmm. That's not the hematemesis either. Oh boy. Anyone want to run a timer on how long the mom's heart fight is going to take? Because I feel like the answer is a long time. I might actually have to use the magician here. No, we're fine. Just butt knife her, it's incredibly difficult to butt knife mom's foot.
Okay, Mega Satan Chest Path. We take this, we take this, and we take Hollowed Ground. Oh boy. Yeah, 52 seconds was a lot faster than I thought, but I also landed three or four bombs. Oh boy. Hmm. Scarred Womb. The one with the meat men, right? Yeah. I didn't add any damage since the other room full of meat men, so this should be taking a while too. Although I do have the butt knife now, which if I had balls, I could use that. Oh, that wasn't so bad. The layout would have, was a lot more favorable. Oh, I need as many bombs as I can find. should be using the butt knife more aggressively against chasing enemies like this. Hmm. I'd be really surprised if I don't take some cheap hit in this room. Well, looks like RNGs is on my side. Oh yeah, Dry Baby absolutely solves Mom's Heart. I'm not worried about Mom's Heart. I'm not too worried about Isaac though, uh, either. Although the lasers are a bit annoying. Wheel of Fortune! Okay. Mega Satan on the other hand. For Mega Satan I have the Magician card at least. And like, come on, what are the odds the build is not gonna improve at all until Mega Satan? I'd say pretty low. Because we still go to the chest, right? There's no way the build doesn't improve until then, right? Right? Selling some of the finest copium in the land, by the way. Oh wow, that was a short floor. Okay. Oh god, I just... Every time I have a run like this, I come here to uh, basement uh, or to, to womb one, and then I realize, oh god, what if it's matriarch? Yep, let's find out. Oh no, I can't afford to miss that. Oops. Okay, Matriarch somewhat got solved by Hollowed Ground. Not gonna lie, that was phenomenal. Those five seconds of hollowed ground were enough to, to solve this boss fight for us. This boss is my worst nightmare, I swear to god. Every time I do a custom challenge, it dies at least once to Matriarch. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, is that Star of Bethlehem? No. <laughs> no, dude! I keep miss I have to take Eden's soul, man. I really want Bookworm, but I, I have to take Eden's soul. Like... <laughs> what does, like, what does Book of Virtues do with the... 
with the coupon I, I have to take Eden's soul like there's no there's no way around that I'm even gonna keep clearing on this floor because I need to have that soul charged by the time I potentially hit a devil deal or angel room oh what the heck is this I mean mostly annoying but still I mean, if it's an enemy that doesn't do contact damage, it's the easiest thing in the world to just butt knife them. Lost. Oh, please give me the virus. Actually, I'm capped on move speed. I didn't even realize I'm at 2.0 move speed. I'll still take the virus. It's a little bit of contact damage. That can't hurt. I mean, I can't actively use it, but... Is that hematemesis? No. Nice charged key, though. Yeah, I mean, this is definitely enough charges now to just go to the next floor. <sighs> oh, yeah, we have the we have the stopwatch and the spoon. That shouldn't be enough to get the max speed, though. To, gotta have something else. That's a 48 hour damage uphill. I would love to increase my damage for 48 hours. Oh no. I'm not saying oh no because of that room. That room was child's play. I'm saying oh no because I have to go to the big room. Oh, that's fine though. Is there a second one of these guys over there? I don't remember. Nah, surely they wouldn't put an enemy that goes invisible underground in a room and make it spawn off screen and come towards you right only the one guy surely they wouldn't do that oh wow they actually didn't the damage uphill the legendary damage uphill i feel like that'll forever be a meme in the channel they totally would though yeah i know that was the joke <laughs> There's enough rooms that do exactly that. Oh my god. I want to pull them all together before I start firing at them. Can't really afford to take hits like that. That was really bad. Nope. I can't even kill these exploding flies fast enough, can I? Wow, he jumped into it. Nice. Okay, got him. Nice. Okay, there's still some good in the world, chat. Don't worry, the doors should open in a few seconds. 
I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. They're totally gonna open before I... No, no, got done before the doors opened. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm somewhat tempted to just pop Eden Soul right now. I might actually pop it at the start of the mom's hard fight for two boss items. I feel like that's my best bet here. Oh no, man. What? No, I'm out of here. Ah! Dude, how am I not finding a Tinder Rock either? This is crazy, man. Worst tech X in the history of Isaac. When you start tech X and you think to yourself, oh yeah, easy run, and <laughs> this is the result. Oh Jesus. Oh wow, Fistula, yeah, that's just free item pickups. <laughs> okay. Well, I got a little bit of damage from the meat on the bone. That's okay. Don't lose the bone heart. <laughs> Don't lose the bone heart. Oh no! What did I do to deserve that one? I didn't even know that can be in here. <laughs> it's not fair, man. Oops. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Pride. I mean, look, if he drops the anarchist cookbook, that's actually pretty good. Because that's bookworm, and it's not a terrible use item, honestly. Especially not with the fanny pack. And the fact that it, it tends to spawn items in the middle of the room. Come on, give me the cookbook. Thank you. Sacrifice room time. Yeah, let me go. Let me get on that with all those hearts I don't have on the floor. <laughs> also, I don't even have a sack room. <laughs> Well, I definitely gotta go for that one. <gasps> it's a sign chat. Mulligan? Yeah, I'm going for that. I, I could roll and try and greet it out, but honestly, Mulligan is really good.
That's a good item. I still want to clear as many rooms as I can. Because every room is a potential bomb drop. Twenty twenty or no, not twenty twenty, but bookworm is definitely a run changer. Oh no! Oh, yeah, look at how they lined up, dude! They just lined up to die. At least on the first go around. Jesus! Imagine starting one of the strongest items in the entire game, and then this is the result. Unbelievable. It's a bit risky, but I'll go for it. Okay. Super Secret is probably there. I'll give it one shot. Nope. Probs probably kicked the dog in his previous life. Okay. Get to the side, park Dry Baby in front of me, and I should be pretty safe from damage here. Jawbone actually blocks projectiles too, so that's pretty neat. Them. No angel room, no devil deal. Okay, we can do a thing here. I have exactly enough health on the ground to, to do a thing. We can peek inside the... Um, the curse room and decide if it's worth losing our bone heart. No, oh, there's enemies in there, and bye-bye, Boneheart. <laughs> That's unfortunate. <laughs> That's really unfortunate. Oh. I should look for the secret room, right? Shouldn't be too many possible locations. Okay, okay. Huge. And the super secret is here, right? Okay. Oh, big room, big room. Huge. Huge. Oh yeah. Huge, huge super secret room. That was large. Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, this one. I still need to learn the lyrics of this song in the background so I can actually sing along. I know I say this every time I get here, but one day, don't worry. One day I'm going to serenade you in Latin chat and everyone's going to be like, Oh my God! Problems. Great Spanish. I, I don't know. I feel like if you win this run, burn penny should definitely be in the thumbnail. I win this run, the thumbnail is just going to be a giant white screen with the poop in the center. That's what this run is. 
that help? Hollowed ground, definitely putting in some work here. Pretty sure almost every room so far where hollowed ground dropped it actually put in some work. Wow, I'm actually really surprised that the horse died before death. This smells like super ziggurat room, but bombs are such a valuable resource right now that I really want to see more of the floor before I take a wild guess. Oh, what the heck. Okay. Game's gonna have to drop me some red hearts. Actually, I have enough red hearts on the ground. Let's go. Why do I even bother? Like, <laughs> this is not the kind of run where you find a good curse room. Where's damage? To the left. You can see I have a whole 2.86. Old ground is your only source of DPS. Excuse me, I found meat on the bone on the last floor. That is also a source of damage, a whopping 0.3. And to be fair, Mulligan is also a source of damage. Mulligan is basically a mini damage multiplier. Justice. Man, if that was a reverse justice, it could have been a game changer, but a regular justice? Jawbone is damage. <laughs> True. Oops. Oops. Jawbone run changer. Oh, come on! Oh, that was bad. That was terrible. Hmm. There's a door at the top. Why do I feel like that's gonna stay closed after this fight because it's a challenge room? gonna open <sighs> probably gonna have to go through there right oh that's fine like that's gonna take forever but it's not a difficult room I haven't accidentally split any of them yet. Like, Super Envy is still unharmed. Which is good. That's what I want. Until everyone else is dead. Okay, that's one Envy down. That is one down. That's like one and a half down at this point. Dude, look at this shot speed. Also not what you want with tech eggs. But every tears up I found so far was also shot speed up. Alright, that's two down. Now for the bad boy. Alright. 
Am I gonna do the Benny Hill for the YouTube? No. Much as I would want to. With copyright strikes being so rampant nowadays, that's not really a song you can play on your videos. Am I gonna regret this? Like, I really wanted to blow up the fire. <laughs> and I knew it was gonna get hit with how uh, this thing generates bombs nowadays. It also hit up here, which means the super secret can't be there. It didn't hit there. Oh, good lord. It's mostly annoying. I might have to step away for a hot minute in a moment, so I just heard the doorbell. Actually, no, that sounds like my girlfriend is opening a package. Can't even go in there, man, because I don't have enough. What? No, come on, I need the super secret. Oh, sloth? That could be huge, because I, I could get a demon card here or something for the Isaac fight. against humanity I, I mean i have to <laughs> i don't i don't have a choice i literally do not have a choice oh wow i didn't know that happened yo dude my eyes <laughs> oh Come on, I have petrified poop. I'm supposed to find some good hearts. Not two eternals. That's good. I mean, that was pretty good. There's a soul heart over there. That was pretty decent. Tech X made this very... Imagine if I had to clear that with a tier build. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, actually, yeah. Greed Scholar actually put in some work here. You're right. Where's the super secret? What? Dude, it's all the way to the left, is it? Yeah, it's all the way to the left. Yeah, I intend to pick up all these other coins in a, in a hot minute as well. I just want to um, see if there's anything I can spend my money on in the super secret. That's why I left them. Aha. I'm afraid we're going to be here for a while, chat. <laughs> I don't care about these. Can that bum give an item? That bum can give a bunch of items, yes.
I think that's enough. I do want to stay <clears throat> at 99 coins if possible for the heart containers from Greed's Golden. Oh, I should pick that up again. Oh, I should have picked that up before picking up most of the money in here. That was a huge mistake. Hmm. We could play the dude some more, but I think we're fine. What's in here? Okay. What? Okay, a bit surprised that hit me. He's totally gonna try and chase me, is he? There's no way I'm dealing enough damage for him to immediately teleport away again. Isaac chases you. He has like a melee phase here if you don't deal enough damage to him. Like there, see? Like the one where he, he tries to fire at you and he comes at you. He only teleports off the screen after a certain amount of damage has been dealt to him. But since most of the time you deal that amount of damage while he fires his first flurry of tears, you never really see that. All right, only one left. Surely. Surely I'm gonna find at least one good item in the chest, right? Of the loss, I have black handle. Not gonna happen. Can't believe I'm at the point of min maxing where I'm at 99 coins and I'm chasing a cardio penny for, for burnt penny procs. <laughs> Sorry, you took the black handle like three hours ago. <laughs> Oh, I mean, that's damage. That's the same amount of damage as the meat on the bone. But hey, damage is damage. I'm above three damage now, chat. I made it. That doesn't do anything. I don't think he drops anything in the Satan fight, but I might as well take him. Unicorn stump. And oh, that's that's insane. That is really good. <laughs> okay, that might actually be the run winner. <laughs> all right let's get it over with <laughs> let's go for our 10 minute mega satan fight i don't think it's gonna take 10 minutes i got some damage now and i got the homing This is a delirium run? Yes, as demonstrated by the delirium PNG at the bottom of the screen. I want to save the ghost bombs for the actual hard parts of the fight though. One of which is this wave, the other one of which is the quadruple mid boss wave. And only then, after I know how much I have left, do I want to use them on Mega Satan. The rest of the bombs is probably reserved for Mega Satan Phase 2. Because he doesn't leave the screen on that, so I can get the maximum value out of those bombs. 
Also, my anarchist cookbook should be producing ghost bombs too, right? Oh, I'm gonna try that on the quadruple sin phase. I think I think we're good at this point, you know, but it was a long road. All those ghosts. Get them, boys. Heck yeah. Truly <laughs> was a long road. I I don't think I've I've struggled quite this much on a run in a really long time. But well, we finally got there. <laughs> I found two damage ups over the course of the entire run, and it was two of the smallest possible ones as well. Get him, little guy. Hey, I mean, there's a decently large subset of players who probably would have lost this. There's also a decently large subset of players who would have used the D100 more often and absolutely knocked this out of the park. And there's another decently large subset of players who would have used the D100 more and died on basement too. Like, I don't know. The, the, the funny part is we never know, or at least unless you play the seed, you'll never know like just how strong this run could have potentially gotten. If I played around with the D100 more, but you could also test this and find out that the run actually had no chance with any amount of D100 uses past the first. Let's go. Probs explaining hopium and gopium. <laughs> GG. <laughs> no, 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 no.